Hello, and welcome to Nextara's video series on the Salesforce Developer Workbooks. In this track, we'll be walking you through the Force.com workbook. This series covers Chapter 1, Create an App and Database, and this video covers Section 6, Load Data Using the Custom Object Import Wizard. In many cases, you'll need to import pre-existing data into Salesforce. In this tutorial, we'll cover loading data from a CSV, or comma-separated value file. This is a basic but common type of file that can store spreadsheet data. We'll be using a sample data file for this tutorial. You can download it from this URL. Save the file somewhere on your computer that you'll be able to locate it in a few moments. Return to Salesforce, then click Setup. Type Import in the Search All Setup box, and click Import Custom Objects. Click Start the Import Wizard. Make sure Merchandise is selected, then click Next. Leave the Prevent Duplicates option at No, and then click Next. It's possible to have a field in your data to specify the owner of each record that's created. But leave this option at None, and all records will be created with yourself as the owner. Then click Next. Click Choose File. Then choose the file you downloaded. Click Open. And then click Next. On this screen, you map the fields in your data to the fields in Salesforce. Because we use the correct names for the fields in the data, they're already mapped. Click Next, then click Import Now. Finally, click Finish. The data will now be imported. Because we're only importing a few records, the import will happen almost immediately. Click the Merchandise tab. Now to see all records, you'll have to make sure the view is set to All, and then click Go. Now you can see the three records we've just imported. In our next video, we'll move to Chapter 2, Customize a User Interface, and cover Section 1, Create Views of Data. Thank you for joining us. For more great content, click to follow us on Google+.